Six months today and no sign, not a trace of Summer Moon, Utah Wells. The last known photo is of her propped up against two gallons of milk, 80 degrees out or better, windows up according to the mother, with no air conditioning. She's dressed in a jogging suit, zipped up all the way up. She appears to have questionable markings on her body from her right ear, which looks like it's turned black, to the nail beds having dark coloration, thickness of her thighs, swelling of her hands, her lips look funny. Everything in the picture tells me something is not right. And I'm about to dig in with you. If you are new to a level 11 tarot, we are a true crime tarot community and family, and you are very welcome. And this is a safe place to express yourself. And also, if you are returning, welcome home. And I enjoy these times with you, 8 o'clock every night, U.S. Central Time. We'll do a premiere together. And tonight, we're going to dig into the milk video of Summer Moon Utah Wells and the last known video or recorded document of her. And let's see what we have. We're going to leave this burning for hope, for summer, for justice. If you have headphones on, I would highly recommend taking them off. And with that, I'm going to hit this one, two, three times. Archangel Michael, hold my hand, please. As I walk through the tarot, protect me from all spiritual weapons and all material weapons that none should prosper against me. Thank you for all of the protection. Archangel Raphael, thank you for returning my health. Every day I feel stronger. I appreciate all the TLC. I appreciate that love and kind and healingness. Archangel Gabriel, thank you for the information and the guidance as we do these readings. Please show me clearly what is the signature, the energy signature of Summer Moon Utah Wells while in the back seat of the vehicle while she lay on the two milk cartons. Show me what it is that I need to see to be able to share the clear, truthful message for the highest good of Summer Moon Utah Wells. Thank you for the abundance, the blessings, the protection, and the guidance. My nose is itching. Okay, Osho Zentero. Summer's energy in the back seat. Leaning on the milk curtain. Summer's energy at the time. Thank you. I feel the energy. Yep. It's coming. It flipped. Ripeness. Something was ready. Ripeness. She was getting picked. Ripeness. Understanding. We have the Doves of Peace. Okay, her signature, signature was at peace. Okay. Was she alive? Was Summer Moon Utah Wells different deck? Okay. I was told to get a different deck. We're going to use a good tarot. I do that knocking to clear any residual energies if I haven't prepared a deck. Just so you guys know, somebody asked. Why do you do that? How come you don't do it all the time? <laughs> if I pre-shuffle the decks, then I don't worry about it because I've already done it. Thank you. All right, here we go. Ten of Pentacles. It's about everything. It's receiving everything. So is she alive? Higher learning. 
messenger of earth, sun, and five of fire. All right, let me understand this a little better. So we have the ten of earth. We have higher learning. Could see this as church. She was at peace. Here, font, higher learning. There was a messenger of earth. Oops, sorry, guys. With the struggle of messages going back and forth about the sun. Not the daughter, the son. She was at peace in the back seat. But I'm not getting the answer I need. It's like an in-between here. A touch and go. Like on the halfway. So halfway alive. Osho Zentero, please qualify. Please qualify her energy signature. Was she alive in the back seat of the car or truck? Nothingness. She was transferring. That card's been coming out a lot. She was transferring. She may have been needing last rites at that moment for all I know. Control breakthrough. Traveling. Traveling. Control. Fighting. Breakthrough. Summer went traveling because of fighting and there was a collision. There is a collision. There is a collision prior to this milk pitcher. Show me this collision prior to this milk pitcher. What is this collision with? Please show me this collision, this break, breakthrough. What brought her to nothingness? Thank you. Change. A change. A serious change. A universal change. There was a collision of some sort. There was a source that brought the collision. Winds of change guidance. All right, let's get some tarot on this. A little bit more tarot on this. We're going to use this... Um, the Light Sears Tarot. Now, other tarot users have used this. It's new to me. Okay, I did prepare it, but I just wanted to do that. Let me see Illumination, the source, the messenger. So, she's half in and half out of life. Qualify while she's ten of cups. She's happy. She's happy. The Hierophant, higher learning. Higher commitment. Going holding on four of pentacles holding on but look at the staircase up right up to heaven holding back a little but headed to your ten of cups your emotional satisfaction What is that red stain on Summer's outfit? Show me the red stain. How? Eight of Swords. It's injury. Eight Swords, mental prison. I keep getting wrist bound. I keep getting wrist or bound. Wrist were bound. We're wrist bound. Or did someone just feel stuck? Mm. 
wounded soldier. There was a battle. I'm not kidding. There was a fight. She was having to defend herself. There was a fight. She tried to defend herself. Eight of Cups. Walking away. So it almost looks like the same girl, does it not? All right, so she gets in a fight with who? Show me this fight. Who'd she get in a fight with? Who was the fight with that she walked away from? Nine of Cups. That is so strange. It's almost like this person trips and just falls through the air flies through the air and all the cups spill and I know that's not what nine of cups means but intuitively I'm picking it up that like the cups get spilt nine of cups show me this eight of cups nine of cups what was this fight about what is this fight about with the knight of swords I cannot make it up she got in a fight with one of the brothers. The Knight of Swords. There's a motorcycle in that picture. And he's got an arrow on his back. Rash. His motorcycle's getting away from him. So she gets in a fight with the Knight of Swords. Then what? What did the Knight of Swords do? Queen of Wands. I'm going to do it my way. I'm going to go my way. Somebody that tries to take their power back. Queen of Wands. What is this Queen of Wands? What is this Queen of Wands energy, please? Okay. We're going to go over here. We're going to take this love, trust, and growth. We have death and rebirth. When this Knight of Wands took his power back, we've got Death and Rebirth with the White Horse of the Knight of Wands, of the Knight of Swords. That's that White Horse. The Chariot and the Death Card. What giving to two, not paying attention. And having that aha moment. Oh my God. What is this aha moment, please? Trust. Show me this aha moment of this death and rebirth in the chariot, please. She that knoweth that does not speaketh. Show me this death and rebirth. Hmm. Strength. Protection. About this fight that was out of balance with the Two of Pentacles, Five of Wands. Protecting this fight. Protecting this fight. Hiding this fight. I wish I could talk louder, you guys. I try, but when I'm trying to do this, <laughs> I need to put on my Amazon wish list a microphone that can go on my shirt that can broadcast to my phone. That would be great. Introspection, or maybe I just need headphones that I plug into my phone that allow me to. We have a card up. The star wanting attention. Wanting attention. Somebody's wanting attention. The star wants attention. Okay, so the star is getting attention. How? Wanted attention from the Knight of Cups. And I think of H as the Knight of Cups. What's going on here? 
What is this about? Ten of Wands. Burden. The burden. Putting the burdens down. With the Queen of Cup. Five of Swords in reverse. Not wanting to fight anymore. So the Knight of Cup is wanting healing. Um, and wanting to put the burdens down about this Queen of Cup and this hidden fight. What is this fight? What is this fight? There was a fight with Summer or around Summer. And Summer got hurt. I know that. The Hermit. It happened in the home. Pulling your energy back towards yourself. Why did Summer pull her energy back toward herself? Why? Because of the manipulator. And she wanted a new beginning. Summer got mad. Did Summer get mad? Did Summer get mad? Yes. Yes, she got mad about the house. About the family dynamics. Summer got mad. Did Summer get mad? Because of the Knight of Wands. He did something to her, and she was going to tell. She went to get help to tell. Because, oh my God, because he was toxic. He did something to her, and she went to tell. And that's when the tower happened to keep her from telling. She... One of them did something. What did he do to make her not tell? What did he do to keep her from telling? Five of swords. In Okay. Judgment. He judged her to keep her from telling. From telling the daddy figure, the emperor, about what happened. She had something. She had proof of what he had done. Look at those little hands, those dirty little hands. She had proof of what he had done. She was going to tell Daddy. She was going to tell Daddy. Yeah, King of Pentacles. She was going to tell Daddy. about this gathering of the kids and what the Knight of Pentacle knew. She was going to tell on the brother. What is this in the milk? What is with the milk? Page of Pentacle evidence. Anguish. When I ask what's with the milk. Where was Summer going? Let me rephrase that. Where was Candace taking Summer? Ten of Swords. It's over. Those are the blackbirds. To the King of Cups. Who's this King of Cup? Where was Candace taking Summer in the milk photo where she's almost over with? Past. To close the cycle, get last rites. She's going to the church. She went to the church. She took the baby to the church. She took the baby to the church. Bam. Six of Wands victory. Getting recognition for Summer. Because of the confusion. Didn't know what to do. Took her to the church. Single little energy all by herself. Yeah, seven of swords, liar, cheater, thiefer. Candace took the baby to the church. Yes, four of cups. Trying to overlook what happened. Didn't know what to do. She took the baby to the church. Yes, to get out of this chaotic place. Temperance, Archangel Michael seeking protection. Eight of wands. Communication to the church, seeking protection from the church. Yes, about the Empress. Summer gave birth to the world, you know. Look at that. The moon, yes. The sun and the moon, Alpha and Omega. 
Oh my God. Wow. That's why the church pulled back. Because they didn't need the law, king of swords, coming in. What has the church done? What has the church done? What? Thank you. Ace of Cups offered a cup of love for the Page of Wands. Paying attention, watching about this nightmare. Nine of Swords laying this to rest with regret. Five of Cups. Is that why we're hearing rumors about the church maybe getting property from the wells? Are they holding something they did? Maybe they covered it up. Maybe they protected this. Maybe there was essay by this brother. Did the apple far fall far too fall? You know what I'm saying. Did the apple fall off the tree? Whatever the saying is. Or something about the church covering this up. Candace went to the church. That's what she was doing, according to this reading. Now I do my best to interpret the cards. This to me looks like there was a fight. Summer tried to go get help to tattle. And that could be the footprint. She took off to get help. Somebody may have snatched her back up from getting help to tattle and taken her back to the property. But they stopped her from telling. They have this devil card. They are the knight of wands. They take her back to the home. Then the tower happens. Summer, Solstice, the sun, the sun. The shining light is on the sun. Spotlight on the sun. I'm not kidding. And I'm not trying to do this to target anybody. Wolf instinct. Childhood innocence and rebirth spring. Somebody's going to talk this out about this passing of this child. She was going to tell. They did something naughty. She was telling. She left. They went and got her, brought her back. River movement. And then they stopped her from telling on them. Yes. Submerged iceberg. Lightning power. Somebody stopped her from telling on them. They did something. It will be released. Water. Effortless. It will come in like a floodgate. You cannot raise children in a sexual environment with no rules, no boundaries, no stability, chaos, drugs, abuse, and expect the children not to lash out. They have no coping skills and Something happened with the, the siblings here that caused Summer to go tell. She was the one seeking help. And she was snatched up and taken back to stop from getting help. And it looks to me like she ended up in that car where the mother found her. Somewhere on the property, possibly in the basement. Maybe they just tried tying her up to keep her there because she was mad, wanted to leave. I don't know. That's for another reason. reading. This is intense. Justice for summer, six months. My God, come on. You people know what happened out there to your daughter. You damn sure do. I have done 25 readings or better. Candace Bly. You are not protecting your child by not speaking truth. Don Wells. 
what truly happened to Summer Moon Utah Wells. It's time. The cards are showing there was a fight. The cards are showing that your boys may have harmed Summer. That there may have been sexual assault in your family. That CPS was coming is something that we all know. Why is Summer gone? I love you guys to the moon and back. I'm sorry I got so emotional. I've just... I'm so frustrated by this case. We'll take a few breaks, a few days off the Summerwell case so that I can regain my composure. I believe we do have another missing child that we severely need attention to. Um, he keeps coming up, and uh, I feel like we need to look at him. I'm going to grab this information now. His name is... Dylan Eiler playing outside, and um, it happened in 2020. But the, this Dylan Eiler, I really think we should look at it. And I would have just asked you to stretch your heart out just a little bit to let in another child. You know, that's what Summer would want, is us looking for other kids too. So please help me. Spread the word about Dylan Eiler, and we will do a reading on his little energy next. He is only three. They found his little rubber boots by a stream. He was gone in 18 seconds. Let's dig in. I love you guys to the moon and back. God bless you. If you felt like this was worthy of your time, please hit that like button. Give it a little tap. God bless you. I love you to the moon and back.